Hi, I'm Martin. I'm the developer of Nowhere Profit. And uh, welcome to the first developer update. I'm going to make a bunch of these probably every month or maybe more uh, to sort of keep you in the loop what's happening. I could write this all down, but A, that's going to take time to write down and B, uh, I like to watch videos more than I like to read text. So I decided to go with video. I hope you don't mind. Um, so it's been a week since the game's been out and it's it's been a week. I came in with, with very low expectations, uh, sort of 20 people buying the game and most of them being friends and family. Uh, ended up being almost 60 purchases now, which is nice. And what is especially nice is that um, most of them aren't friends and family. So hi to all you new guys playing the game and liking the game. Um, if you didn't like the game, let me know. I'd love to know what I can do better. Um, yeah, and I also... Um, uh, thankful for all the bug reports and all the discussion that's been going on on the forums and on the Discord. Uh, there's been really good insight into the cards and sort of the balancing and like how players perceive things. Because after working on this thing for three years, my perspective is very, very different. So it's really good to kind of get this new input. There's been a few streams. People have been playing the game online and that's been, that's been great to watch. Um, I've um, exhibited the game at conferences, but it's very different from watching somebody play for like 10 minutes and looking over their shoulder uh, to somebody playing at home and sitting down for a longer time. So that's been that's been really good too. So pretty nice on the sales. Uh, it's not big money, but it's it feels good. Uh, a bunch of cool streams, um, a patch release, um, which I made an active discord. That's all good. So what's coming next? There's probably going to be another bug, bug fix um, this week or early next week. There's a bunch of things I really want to touch. Um, some core things have been have been broken. I'm looking at Poison specifically. Um, none of these will be big sort of content or balance changes. That's what I want to do between now and the release, which if nothing else fails, is going to be somewhere in the middle of next year, which is about six and eight months from now. Um, what I want to do in this time is focus on content and make the game better which means there's probably going to be some system tweaks in there some interface improvements but mostly i want to work on content and the next update is going to be in november it's going to be a big update and i want to focus mainly on content uh, specifically on card balancing uh, on the starting deck and on the way the enemies are put together i feel like the difficulty is too high in the beginning and not doesn't ramp up well enough and some of the decks don't provide enough variety so I sort of want to touch on the system that uh, defines how enemies are put together and sort of tweak that and allow for more um, control from my side and sort of make the decks better. Which will also probably include some new deck, some new cards, uh, tweaks to some systems, like I'm thinking about changing the way wounds work by making uh, followers a lot more vulnerable, but then again giving you more. So yes, your deck becomes more fluid and it's more of a, oh, what am I going to change? Somebody's in danger. Am I really going to put him in? So there's a bunch of ideas I have for balancing changes, which I'm going to roll out. You can look forward to that. Um, besides that, I also really want to um, uh, increase the, the size of the game, which is there's going to be another map after the current map. Uh, there was a buggy version uh, in the release where you could actually cheat your way through and see those maps. Um, but... I, I took that out because it sort of caused some other weird issues. So anyway, I want to add another map, but that's not entirely certain. Uh, but what I also want to do is um, I want to add the first unlockable, um, which has always been on the plan for Nowhere Profit to give you sort of like progress over multiple games. Um, and I want you to be able to sort of decide what you're starting out with. There's, there's going to be two types of unlockables in the game. A classes, which determine your leader deck that you start with and the sort of cards you get as you level up. And convoy, which is um, the, the, the convoy deck you start out with and a bunch of resources. Um, and there's going to be a fir the first unlockable is going to be in the next update, which um, you can discover and then you can, before you start a new game, you can select which of these you want to take and then it'll change the way you begin the game and sort of interact with the world. Yeah, I think that's everything. If you've got any questions, please let me know. You can email me, you can go to the itch forums, or you can just hang out on the Discord. Links will all be uh, in the description below. Um, yeah, and that's it. See you next time and stay hydrated.